with web development, we have you know PHP, we have Node.js and JavaScript, um, Django and Python and Ruby on Rails with Ruby. So is Kotlin going to be within that that area of web development? Because right now it's popular with Android. Will it cross into the web development area? And I believe for JavaScript, since Kotlin can um, convert to JavaScript, not natively, but you can use it with the JVM, I think in the future JavaScript is going to be somewhat replaced. I don't think it's going to be replaced, but um, you know, there is, I believe there's TypeScript um, from, from, from Microsoft or however you call that. Uh, and, and I think that JavaScript will be replaced by something such as Kotlin or Microsoft Solution, mainly because a lot of people just want to change JavaScript. They don't want it how it is right now. It's not clean. Um, Kotlin has a lot more features, and a lot of other programming languages have a lot more features, and they want those. Some of that JavaScript won't have and, and, and doesn't have kind of like Python, for example, but you still have to use JavaScript as well for things. So with Kotlin, you have the option, you know, you, you can put Kotlin with Java Spring, you can do Kotlin alone with Java, you can do it with uh, Ktor or, or, or Ktor, however you want to say it. Um, that's, that's Kotlin's backend web framework, specifically for Kotlin. So you have Ktor, a native solution for Kotlin, you have Spring Framework, and you have any JavaScript framework out there. So you have three choices. I think Kotlin is going to come up on top and it's going to beat out um, not JavaScript as a whole, but it might be on the leaderboard for web development soon, maybe in the next coming year or two. It will become you know one of the top ten of programming languages for web development. It's going to go in that area, I do believe.